ladies week. and gentlemen, and welcome to this, uh, well, another snow report from Sousy Online. It's, um, I have no idea, Friday the what, 14th is it? I think it's the 14th. It's, uh, anyway, it's the Friday after the last video we did. We think it's the 14th. Um, <laughs> here we are at the top of San Sicario. We've just been for a very nice lunch. Uh, best pizza. Amazing, Amazing pizza. pizza. Uh, nice bit of gnocchi, glass of red wine, happy days. Um, but uh, you don't want to know about our gastronomic um, activities. You'd like to know what the snow's like. And um, well, it's very much improved since last week. I think it's fair to say this week has been great. If you've been out here this week, I'm sure you will agree. We didn't quite get the um, 20 odd centimeters that was forecast. Sorry, I've just realized I got my goggles on. How very rude of me, I do apologize. Um, yeah, so um, we didn't quite get the 20 centimeters of snow that was promised last week. Um, but we got about, I don't know, five or six centimetres possibly. Um, but it's amazing how much difference that made. It really did make, a, well, yeah, just, it made a difference. <laughs> yeah, that coupled with the uh, colder temperatures as well meant the cans were firing during the evening. So uh, it, it's, it's amazing how different today is to this time last week when we were, we were skating around on pretty icy slopes. As you can tell from the, beautiful blue sky behind me um, there is not a cloud in the sky and uh, there's no wind either we've got very calm uh, weather pattern hanging over us at the moment whilst we've got this high pressure we're certainly enjoying the calmer conditions and the blue skies it's absolutely wonderful so we'll go for a little ski around San Sicario uh, show you the uh, slopes around here and then um, we'll come back and give you a quick um, weather forecast for the week ahead <laughs> quiet on the mountain at the moment this week as well um, no lift queues absolutely no lift queues so you're straight on to all the lifts which is great and um, as I say the snow is holding up really nicely this uh, this, this week the temperatures during the day um, well the, the week started off very cold it did feel like we were back skiing in January so uh, that way she's good that's what you want so we had that squeaky snow return which I think it's the first time we've had squeaky snow this year, um, which was very pleasant indeed. Uh, but now the temperatures are starting to rise a little bit. It's a little bit warmer this afternoon, uh, but very pleasant indeed. Makes for excellent skiing. So here we are on the Black 21, which comes from the uh, top of um, Fratevi. For those of you who've been out to Sousa before, it's the, the top of the dogleg drag, going back into San Sicario. We've got the uh, magnificent Mount Shabberton behind us with the uh, fort on top. I'm not quite sure whether you'll be able to make out the, um, the turrets there, but uh, that is the Shabberton. And uh, yeah, so here we are on the Black 21 and it's skiing wonderfully. There are no cannons on here, so this all, all this is natural snow. And um, yeah, it, it's, it's really, really nice indeed. So the, uh, the calm weather 
that we're experiencing at the moment is due to the high pressure that's currently over the uh, area. Um, the jet stream is making sure that all the weather systems are staying away from us and we've got this um, prolonged period of, um, of calmness, um, which obviously uh, we're not going to get any weather, uh, but we do have lovely blue skies and not a cloud in the sky and it's wonderful. Now, the looking at the long-term forecast, it does appear like possibly for the next 10 days we are going to have this high system over us. Um, the temperatures are possibly creeping up a little bit next week, uh, but during the evening they should still be sub-zero. Um, but during the, um, the, the day, certainly in the afternoon, um, it could be getting a little bit warmer, but nothing to worry about, I would say. And then potentially around about the 24th of uh, January, we um, might be seeing a bit of a change to the weather, but that is too far off in the distance to, uh, to concern ourselves with. If you're coming out next week, all you'll need to know is that blue sky, sunshine, good pistes, plenty of snow awaits. getting asked quite a bit about our Apre ski programme. For obvious reasons this year we're not doing it, so the Tuesday meet in Moncrons and the Thursday up in Sportinia, um, until things um, improve we're not going to do that. But we do have helmet stickers behind the bar in Moncrons, so go along and see Mark and Karen and uh, grab your helmet sticker. Um, if you want some hoodies or t-shirts, drop me a line and we'll sort that out for you as well. It never ends. back on the Southie side of Fratevi and uh, we've had a very enjoyable day in San Sicario. Um, I sincerely hope those who have been out here this week have had an enjoyable week and I hope that this video is um, heightening the excitement levels for those coming out next week and uh, so expect nice clear blue skies and yeah uh, lots of sunshine and plenty of skiing. Just one word on, um, on Covid, uh, there's nothing really changed since the last video Potentially next week we might be going into the orange zone here in Italy, but uh, if you're vaccinated, which if you're coming out on holiday you will be, nothing's going to change for you. So the bars are still open, the restaurants are still open, uh, you still have to wear your FP, uh, FFP2 mask on the gondola down into Sestriere and wear the mask in, in the streets and everything. So basically it's status quo on that front. So um, yeah, we'll just have one last run of the day, eh love? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> so if you are out next week, hopefully see you on the mountain. If we do see you, say hello. Hi. Oh.